teacher Kathy here. All right, I'm creating this video with an addition to more tips and tricks about the new self-paced classes on OutSchool. I got a question on my YouTube channel about something in there, and it took me a little bit to figure out what they meant by this question, so I hope that this helps at just there, 3794, since you posted this question. And I'll put a link in the comments for you as well, so that way you can find the video. All right. So, excuse my voice if it sounds funny, i am got a cold. Alright, so let's go ahead and look at one of my classes, okay? Oh, before I do that though, don't forget to click on the subscribe and the like and the bell. It really does help my channel and move me up there in YouTube. And that is my goal, to try to continue to make helpful content for you as an online teacher. Alright, here we go. Now I'm going to share my screen with, we want to go there. So this is a current out school class that is currently listed for um, the new subscription based. And so we're going to go into this and take a look at it and see if I can answer this question. I think I know what they mean. Their question was, um, <clears throat> I noticed that in your video you didn't really say if we should put it to save for learners enroll. They're all learners. That part is confusing to me. Are they talking about all learners in the past and present? Right now I'm so mad at myself for not doing this sooner, but I can see how this would be actually good for teachers. So I'm trying to help them figure out what they mean by all learners. Okay, so let's go and take a look. So if I go into the posts under this class, and I click on posts and I go down here and I edit one of these posts that I've already made. If I click on the edit, it gives me the option down here, right here. It says all learners, enrolled learners only or subscriptions only. What this means is, is this is for the subscription based addition to the self-paced classes. Students can enroll in the self-paced classes. This is how I understand it from the information I've gotten from OutSchool. If I misquote something, please go look to OutSchool and ask OutSchool support. So all learners means both subscription and self-paced. Enrolled learners only mean just self-paced. Subscription only means just subscription only. So the difference is self-paced is where learners enroll in your self-paced class, which is the replacement for Flex. And all the posts are scheduled automatically for you. They can purchase weekly or all at once. And there is interaction with the teacher on the weekly posts. And assignments are turned in and teachers get feedback and grades and so on. Subscription only is just the content. No interaction from the teacher, no grading, no assignments submitted, just the content to use on their own as they please. Okay, so you can choose that when you are listing your self-paced classes. If you want the content you are listing under each post, under each lesson, to be just for self-paced only, or just for subscriptions, or both. I hope that clarifies it. All right, if it doesn't, feel free to put a comment below with your questions, and I will do my best to answer them as soon as I can, and hopefully be able to make more content for you answering those questions. Don't forget to click on that like button and subscribe, because that really does help my channel, and I will see you in the next one. Okay. Bye-bye.